side of the truck and we bring them straight out to the home. So we're never double handling. The uh, valets uh, are 7x7x5 seven by seven by units. So they're good for Northern Virginia with townhouse. They fit in the driveway. So they're very secure. So we basically drop these off at the customer's home. The customer can load them, get all the declutter out of the house. room right in front of you though is our trading room. Paintings, uh, marble tubs, um, you name it, um, we create it. We, do, we get it in the computer the night before. I have a gentleman who builds throughout the day and then we have one at night uh, when it comes through in the computer. I uh, make sure that they get a copy of it. They come back here. We have all the wood as we see throughout and boom it goes. The cars, uh, a certain amount of, uh, like, you know, we, we drive them for the customer. We use them a certain amount of time um, and um, see if everything still works. You know, the fluids are okay. This is operations area for JK. Um, it's available at long distance dispatch boat. Um, this is uh, the dispatch board, if you can see it. Um, and pretty much just a quick overview everything is electronic in, in long distance dispatch. Yeah. Day sheets and you know, pretty much online there. But in local and long distance, it's a huge grid, like air traffic control. And um, so, pretty much drivers here, all the available duties that we can see out about a week or two at a time, it just keeps rolling. As we assign, it goes off, this keeps moving up. So, we can see about two weeks out. And we do plan about two weeks out. This is where it really starts um, uh, our training process. So the guys are in here for um, it's a three day basic training course. So they come in after they've completed the application, they've been background checked, the drug test, and, and everything seems to be a fit. Uh, they're here for pretty much a full day going over do's and don'ts, what to say to the customer, what not to say, <laughs> our expectations of them as an employee. Um, uniform, dress codes, start times, um, you know, the difference between the roles of a helper versus a driver versus a project manager. And then after that, the, the other two days are primarily focused on hands-on training outside in the house, going in and out of the truck, learning how to pack, wrap, fold, pads, uh, move furniture, uh, handle uh, washer and dryers, things of that nature. And the main thing I don't want, I don't like for nobody to use a hand truck in the house. Hand truck is out of the picture. You get, you use what God gave you: two arms, your two legs. Walking in the house and walking out. Because people get most of your hand trucks now. You got that wide piece, and when you're coming in, it's sticking out that much to the side. And you're not really looking at anything. You know, you don't hit the wall, and it's like, uh oh, you try to cover it up. Too late. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks so much for coming out. Really appreciate it.